EA Sports. It's in the game. NHL 2005. Q ratings, one and all. Welcome back to Hockey Game History. The series where we take a look at hockey video games that have been released over the years to see if they still hold up today. In today's episode, we are going to be looking at a 14-year-old title in EA's long-running series as we have a go at NHL 2005. NHL 2005 was developed by EA Black Box, published by EA Sports, and was released on the Nintendo GameCube, the original Xbox, the PlayStation 2, and Microsoft Windows between September 14th and October 8th, 2004, dependent on the console and the region of release. The game's cover features Vancouver Canucks captain Marcus Nasland on the front, as NHL 2005 launched to mostly solid reviews. The game earned either a 75 or 77 out of 100 on its console releases on Metacritic, but it received a measly 66 out of 100 on Metacritic for its PC version. Guess which version we're playing today, folks? That's right, we are playing the supposed worst, clearly worst version of this game, the PC version of NHL 2005. This is going to go well, isn't it, guys? Now, the new features of NHL 2005 include open ice control, a new mechanic to improve how players move without the puck, the ability to import digitised home arenas, vintage NHL jerseys from now-defunct teams such as the Atlanta Flames and the Quebec Nordiques, and an all-new World Cup of Hockey mode, where players can create an international team from scratch and compete for the gold medal. So there's a few gameplay additions from the 2004 counterpart, but it's mostly cosmetic stuff really, isn't it? But enough talking, ladies and gentlemen. Let's get on with this game and see what we can do. So let's let's go with play now. The controls are pretty simple. Arrow keys to move and it's WASD and R pretty much to do everything. So we're going to be the home team. Let's find a random team. Boom. The Edmonton Oilers. Okay, so we're going to be the Oilers and the random away team. Boom. Boston at 85. Okay, this is going to be tough, but we'll do it. 82 overall for the Oilers, 85 overall for Boston. We'll give it a go and see what happens, shall we? So we're going to use the home jerseys back when they had those disgusting ones there. I, pro I much prefer their ones today. So we're going to go medium skill level. We're going to go NHL rules, period length, five minutes, um, ice camera. Yep, looks pretty good to me. So in terms of what actually goes on in this game, it's not too bad. Like uh, W is uh, the hits. Um, S is, oh, here we go. Oh my goodness, it's an oil rig. Here they come, the Edmonton Oilers. Here they are. Hello, Oilers. How you doing, lads? Look at these beautiful, pristine 2004-2005 graphics. They're wonderful, aren't they? Of course, this game was released in the season where the NHL had a full season lockout. So, I assume all of these rosters are the same as 2003-2004. So, I, I would imagine this game isn't really that much different. Oh, no. Is it the 2004-05 season? Which season was it? Was it the 3-4 season or the 4-5 season? Oh, sorry. Sorry, we've got to, we've got to be quiet. There's the, there's the anthems. <laughs> Canada, we love you. <laughs> You're the best. Look at that flag. Look at that flag. So many pixels. <laughs> Yay! Right, okay, good. We're ready to go, gents. We don't even care about the American national anthem, apparently. We're going to go for a standard face-off here, I think. Let's give this a go, folks. Let's see how we do. So, opening face-off. Sean Hawkoff. That's a name, right. And win that face-off. Ah, oh, Sean, Joe Thornton. Joe Thornton, of course. Okay, tried to pass that to a ref. Not a very good idea. Hit him. Lovely hit. Oh, careful. Careful. Murray. Oh, Conklin. Who the hell are you? Don't remember you as the goalie for the Oilers. Oh, Sean Hawkoff. Oh, he gets hooked. He gets hooked straight away on that play. Oh, what a hit. Lovely hit, son. Smith. Let's go, son. Oh, and he gets hit. He gets hit. Oh, I knocked over the wrong player, but apparently that was fine. Oh, defense. Come back. Smith, where are you hitting? There's a penalty, and we're on the penalty kill. So, Jason Smith, two minutes for interference. I believe the captain of the Oilers at the time. Yes, he was. Okay, yeah, that, that technically was interference. I mean, that that's fair. Alice Hemsky, now with the Habs, I believe. Well, I mean, we'll find out soon after. Oh, careful, we got it. Good play. Right, York, let's go. You're a speedster. Get that shot off. Good try, good try, lad. Rolston. Is that Brian Rolston? Oh, that's a great hit on Samsonov. Get that pass. Oh, good pass to Hemsky. He's a speed demon as well. Slap shot. Oh, and a penalty. Andrew Raycroft, of course. Brian Ralston. It was Ralston. Two minutes for interference. 
So this game is quick as hell. I'm getting very much the uh, the feeling of um, NHL 2004 from this, which is good. I'm liking it. I like NHL 2004. It's one of my favourite games of all time. Oh, I do love a bit of this. Right, P Peter Nedved playing for the Oilers. He's, I swear he's with every team. Oh, Patrice Bergeron on the team, of course. Oh, shot. Oh, good try there, Nedved. Good try, son. Come on, lads. Oh, cross. You got it. Good. Kept it in the zone. Okay. Not, not really getting much of a chance there. Christian Dvorak, of course. Right, we got it, goalie. Okay, goalie wanted to pick that up instead. Let's go, Dvorak. Let's go, you speed demon. Shot. Oh, Andrew Raycroft with another save. Another easy save for him. Nylander. I assume that's the uh, dad of William Nylander. Off we go. Off we go. No, okay, maybe not. Oh, no, 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 no. Careful. Oh, good save there, Conklin. Here we go, Gil. You want to fight, son? Oh, good, Conklin. Nice one. Right, Dvorak. Our button is the speed. The need for speed. The shot wasn't really happening. So one of the things that I've noticed is it's really difficult to get past the uh, def uh, the defender. So if you want to go round the net, it's really difficult because they, they seem to pick you up every single time. Oh, the penalties are done with. Uh, Pisani, don't know who that is. Is Bista, I recognise that name from somewhere. Probably one of the previous games. Pisani, good try, son, good try. Bergeron, we've got a Bergeron. Did he change teams? I'm a bit confused. We've got a Bergeron, they've got a Bergeron. What's going on? Careful. Oh, no. And Mike Newball or Mike Newball from Murray and Thornton gets the first goal of the game for the Boston Bruins. They've taken the early lead with a quick wrist shot. Look at that. Conklin was down in the butterfly. He gets the goal. So that's an early deficit for the Oilers. Wow, that was a quick one. I do find that the shooting in this is quite difficult. It's quite difficult to get into a position to take a decent shot. I've got to be honest. Wow, I'm doing really badly in the face-off dot by the looks of it. Conklin, careful, son. Over. Okay, good play to Sean Hawkoff. Let's get that speed going. See, if I want to try and go round, it's really difficult to actually go round. Go. Okay, didn't actually take a shot there, Hawkoff. Would have been nice if you'd wrapped that round a little bit, mate, but no worries. Jarrett Stoll, of course. Of course. Recognising all these names now. It's from my Hockey Game History videos. Oh, no. Just gave him a bloody breakaway. Good job, guys. Good job, defence. I'm impressed. Right, Moro, let's go, let's go, let's go, Moro. Good slap shot attempt, son. Good try, good. Good hit on Thornton, good hit on Gonchar. Ah, uh, Larac. George Larac. Love him. Oh, careful, let's go. Bergeron. Come on, lads. Oh, go. Jarrett, stop. Where was that pass going? It was offside. Not a very good pass there, lads. Got to be honest. Andrew Raycroft. He, of course, played for the Toronto Maple Leafs at one point as well, didn't he? I can't remember which team he played for first. Who knows? Brewer, let's go, son. Let's go. Slap shot. Oh, good try. Okay, and then we get another hit. Brilliant. And that's a penalty. It was a great hit, but apparently they're on the power play again. Interference. Eric Brewer, come on, son. I don't really want to go um, aggressive with the face-offs if we're on the penalty kill. In fairness, that was a bit of a cross-check there. I do get where they're coming from. Right, 5 minutes 54 left in the first period. Can we get this puck? Yes, we can. Ulanov. Ulanov. Oh, good try. Go, York. Sh oh, you should have shot that puck better, son. He was down. He was in the desperation save mode, and he couldn't quite get that. That was a great hit. Samsonov, you are my bitch right now. I just keep hitting you. Oh, Hemsky, let's go. Ah, oh, gets hit just the second I release that button. That's a great hit. Ah, oh, the second I try and take a shot, get hit as well. I'm getting some solid hits here. Samson <laughs> Samsonov, you were just dying. I've hit you like six times in the first period. You fall into the ice with every single one. Careful. Oh, and a short-handed goal for Mike York. Assisted from Alice Hemsky and Conklin. What a snipe there on the glove side. It looked like I'd got hit. Wow, like a laser beam through there. Oh, look at those faces. Hey, I'm so happy I won. <laughs> nice goal though, lads. Short-handed as well. So four minutes 59 left in the first period. Got a minute and four seconds left of the power play. We've still got the puck. It's fine. Oh, good try wide. Oh, Smith, you've got it. Good, good attempt. Good attempt. Okay, let's hit him. Oh, what a hit. I do love the hits in this game. They are so satisfying. I mean, when you pull off a decent hit, oh, you just feel so good about yourself. Igor Ulanov. He's had one hit in the game so far. Good man, good man. Right. Is it a five on four? Yeah, it is a five on four. I was wondering where my other player was. Oh, that's a bad play. It's a bad play. Oh, lovely save, Conklin. Cheers, son. Careful. Are we going to hit him? I guess not. Jarrett stole. Boom! Lovely hit, son. Careful, Smith. Careful, Smith. Tomorrow. Oh, he gets hooked on the play. Oh, and they've taken it back. I mean, technically, that was a hook, but apparently the game's all right with that. 
I, I don't really know what else to say, to be honest. Right, pass. Okay, that was a really bad pass. Careful. Newball. Newball scored a goal for them. Lovely hit on Nylander. Beautiful play. Right, York, you've got your full of energy, son. Go! Oh, he gets hip-checked. Get another chance from Brewer. And he scores! Eric Brewer just flicks that puck into the back of the net. Just as the power play ends for the Boston Bruins. And the Oilers have taken a 2-1 lead. Look at that. Just about flicks it through. Raycroft's five hole. Yay, we did it. <laughs> Look, oh, LaRock's loving it. He loves it. Brilliant. Good man. Right, here's Nedved. Haven't seen much of him. I, lo I can remember so clearly the, um, the uh, little things next to each of the names. Like the speedster one. And, and like the speedster one for Dvorak. The good hitting ones. The accurate shooter ones. Ah, oh, this brings back so many memories. Right, let's go, let's go, let's go. Shot. Oh, okay. No worries, no worries. We've got it still. Okay, Gil took it from us. Get that hit. Oh, what a hit. Offside warning. Rafi Torres. Oh, God. Forgot Torres was on this team. No, thank you. I don't like Rafi Torres. Right, okay, good. It's the first period comes to an end. A 2-1 lead for the Edmonton Oilers early in this game. Conklin made some key saves. We've got some lucky shots there from some of our Oilers players. Eric Brewer with the game-winning goal so far in this game. So, in terms of what I think so far, uh, t uh, 13 shots to 10, 17 hits to 9 in favour of us. They're winning face-offs. We've got more time on attack. We've got more penalty minutes, and nobody scored on the power play so far. On breakaways, fool the goalie by faking one way, then manually deking. I don't really know how to do manual deeks in this, I've got to be honest. I'm using the keyboard, not a controller, so I'm a bit confused. But anyway, um, in terms of what I think about this so far... This game is quite brutal. I've got to be honest. This game, I can see why it didn't get very good reviews. Because it's really difficult to do anything in this game. I have played a few games to test it. And in all of the games I've played, including this one, you can't get to the outside of the defender without him killing you in some way. Um, it's really difficult to get a decent shot on goal. Because the, se the split second you want to take that shot, a defender's taken you out on the ice and probably knocked off your helmet. Um... The passing's a bit weak here. I don't like the fact that two line passes are back on. I could have taken them off, but it's technically not in the NHL rules. Technically, it is because the season didn't get played, but technically it's not, I would also argue. Um, but yeah, like it's a fun game. It's, I love how quick it is. I love how fast-paced and fun and exciting this game is. It's very much kept that feeling from NHL 2004 in, the, in its predecessor, which is brilliant. I like that. It, it just kind of feels like compared to NHL 2004, they've cranked up the difficulty a little bit. Maybe it's because I'm playing on medium. I'm not quite sure. But God, this game is tough to get some shots. I've, I've gotten some really sweaty puck luck goals there to take the lead. I'm, I haven't really played very well, if I'm honest, except for the hits. I love the hits in this game. Hits 10 out of 10. I love them. So let's go for a standard face off here. Here we go. So I made it. Usually it goes that you face downwards the next time. But I've made it the home team always up. Just to make it more realistic to today. Lovely hit, Brewer. Oh, come on, Smith. Come on, Smith. Let's go. So you see that the, the second I try and make a play there, he wasn't even anywhere near me. Okay, that was a bad play. Oh, if only that stayed on side. I got a goal. <laughs> right, Nedved. Let's go, son. Here we go. Good face-off win, Nedved. Oh, split. Like, you, you literally have to make a play in a split second. Because otherwise, you're going to get absolutely rocked by one of their players. Which makes it a very difficult game, but also quite exciting. You have to keep on your toes. I mean, I think I think this game still stands up as like a arcade game. I can see why people might like it. Oh, gone chart. Trying to put that in your own net, son. Thornton coming. Ah, oh, I missed him. Ah, oh, I missed the hit. There you go. Hip check. Oh, good job, Conklin. Cheers, mate. Is Beaster. Oh, that's a great pass to Hemsky. On the, on the breakaway, and they just get the hook in there. Nowadays, that would be an absolute penalty shot. What a hit there. I love these hits. See, I literally need to make that play within a split second. Good hip check. I can't even finish my sentences before the next play's happened. That's how quick this game is. Come on, hit him, hit him. Nubal. Oh, no. Nubal scores his second goal of the game, and he ties it up. His 103rd career NHL goal. Look at this. I tried to hit him. Goes off, goes off Conklin's pads and in the goal. Okay, 14-14 left in the second period. Okay, it would be nice if I could actually make a play here. All right, Nedved. Here we go, son. Here we go. Oh, you see? I can't even get to the, to the boards with this game because the defense just absolutely destroy you. It's offside, mate. Learn the rule. <laughs> right, let's go. Jarrett stole on the third line. 12.58 left in the second period. Still all to play for. Excuse me, can you get out of the way? 
Okay, tried to take that shot. He was in the process of taking it. That is a great hit. Right, icing warning. Good, good. We're going to get a face-off in the offensive zone. Yuri Slegger. Slegger. I don't know how to pronounce that name. But he's uh, not really done much with his uh, game so far. Good play. Slap shot. Okay, blocked in front. Rafi Torres. Oh, Rafi Torres with the chance. Get off my puck. Right, Nedved's got it. Oh, he lost it. He lost it. Where am I going? Where am I going with this? Samsonov, don't make me hit you again. Oh, careful, Conklin. Let's not allow another another goal, please. Don't know where that was going, but Dvorak's got it. Oh, he's found some space. He's found some space. Oh, and Andrew Raycroft makes the save. Oh, no. Hit. Lovely play, son. Lovely play. Good. Nedved, take that long shot. Didn't quite work. No worries. Good. Hit their cross. Steos. Steos, we got it. Good to cross. Over to Dvorak. He's a speedster. Take that long shot. Good. Get that hit on there. Get that hit on there. Good lad. Good lad, Bergeron. How's it going, son? Welcome to the league, mate. Oh, there you go. Samsonov. Samsonov, mate. Oh, how's he still got this puck? He's literally standing right in front of the net. How does that work? Right, come on, Smith. Let's go. That's a great pass to Sean Hawkoff. Oh, he gets hit off the play. I really don't know what play to make there. I've got to be honest. He, he knocked me over. He hit me. You nasty human being. Oh, careful. Don't want Thornton to score a goal. Go to San Jose, Thornton. Oh, that's a great pass to Hawkoff. Shot. Oh, that was close to going in, I think. Careful. Careful. Smith. Ugh. Oh, I missed him. I missed him. Good play. Good. Smith's on it. Over to the other Smith. The Smith-Smith line. Okay, still had the puck there for a moment. Okay, lost it again. No worries. Hemsky. Good play, Hemsky. Oh, careful. Hemsky. Good hit. New ball. You're not getting another goal, mate. I'm sorry, but that's enough from you today. Is Bista shot? Oh, that goes way wide. Careful, fellas. Careful, fellas. Oh, oh no. No, 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 no. Good. Oh, who's got it? Is Bista. Okay. Over to Pisani. Didn't really want to pass to him. Gets hooked on the plate. Ralston. Ralston, have you no shame hooking me on the play? Oh, now that is a hit and a half. End of the second period with a final bone-crushing hit. So the game is tied so far. Yeah, I mean, I'm enjoying this game. I think it's fun. It's definitely... I, I, however, I, I think one of the reasons I'm enjoying this game so much is because of the nostalgia of NHL 2004. It's very much got that look. It's very much got that feel to NHL 2004, which is, of course, one of my favourite games. But, um, yeah, I'm, I'm not quite sure about the actual gameplay itself. N n nostalgia is a big part of why I'm enjoying this, I think. It, it, it's, it's relatively solid. It's a decent game, but I just think... I think it's too tough to try and score. I mean, I've scored two goals in this game. I don't want it to be super easy. Of course not. But this is a tough game. This is difficult. I mean, even the even the best NHL players in the world would have a, would, would struggle with something like this. can't even remember my bloody words. So we're going with the aggressive face-off strategy. Come on, Oilers. Let's win this game, gents. Here we go. Here we go. Come on, Steos. Oh, careful. Okay, I did press the speed boost. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, good shot attempt there by Nedved. Right, we need to get some more hits on here, lads. Okay, tried it there. Bergeron, I hit you, mate. There you go. There you go. Over to Torres. Oh, oh that's a great play, but we can't get the shot off. Oh, here we go. Good shot attempt by Rafi Torres. Good hit there. Nice one. And he's going to cover up. There, he, there you go. I knew it would happen at some point. Right, so we've got our first forward line out there. Hawkoff with uh, a couple of others. Can't remember who they are now. Thornton, you are just a face-off beast in this. Like, he's, he's not wasting any time, is he? Oh, careful. Brewer. Brewer. Get that puck. No. Oh, Conklin. What a save. One thing that I've struggled to do in this game as well is one-timers. No players ever seem to be in the right position to take a one-timer. I know that there's this all, like, open ice hit stuff, but... Okay, that was a bad pass. Okay, that was another bad pass. And they scored. And Newball gets an assist. Newball. <laughs> God's sake, man. Three points on the night for Mike Newball. Leave us alone. Right, 14.53 left in the game. Okay, excuse me. Can we skate the puck, please? Okay, so I'm going to try a one-timer. Okay, maybe I'm not. Okay, so that came completely out of the zone. Good on it. Get on side. What are you taking so long? Ah, oh, my God. Wow, I saw my player all the way up by the bloody goal line. He hadn't come out the zone yet. Good hit. Okay, tried to hit him there. Axelson. It's not happening, mate. It's not happening. Only Newball's allowed to score on us by the sounds of it. 
Hemsky, let's go with the speed boost. And he's about to get hit. Yep. I just don't know how to get past the players. I really don't know. I, maybe it's like a, a button that I'm missing or something. But my goodness. Okay, that was a hip check. Okay, thanks, Conklin, for taking that one, son. Hemsky, be careful. You're about to get hit. Over. There, there, there's nobody there to pass to. That's the problem. Like, I'd pass it if there was somebody there to pass to. Right, Pisani, let's go, son. Let's go. Slap shot. Oh, good try. Good try. Oh, he gets hooked on the plate. All right, careful. Hemsky, that's a great hit. Oh, no. No. Thank you, Conklin. I mean, you've allowed some sweaty ones here, mate. Oh, come on, Smith. Is it Ryan Smith? It is Ryan Smith, isn't it? Oh, go. Oh, good try, son. Good try. <clears throat> wrong player I'm trying to hit there, York. Brew up. Okay, wrong person again. We got this. Good. Oh, that was a bad pass. It's a very bad pass. That's offside. Okay, 7 minutes 31 left in the game. Brewer with a goal, 8 hits, and he's a minus 1. So Brewers must have been on the goal, uh, on the ice for at least 2 goals against. Not very good, is it? Okay, I tried to shoot that puck. Uh, the, the aiming of the puck as well is quite difficult. Uh, Torres, there you go, son. Oh, Nedved, let's go. Oh, come on. Oh, he's got it again. He tries the sharp angle shot. I'm not getting anything here, guys. Good hit there. Good hit. Torres. Okay, I tried the shoot button, but apparently I pressed the wrong button. Okay, final five minutes of the game, and the stars come out because it's the hero line. Samsonov, I went easy on you in the second. Can you, like, maybe go away? Come on, Nedved. Come on, Nedved. Okay, missed that. The other defenseman came over and killed him. Fair play. All right, Torres with that puck. Nice. Over to Dvorak. Let's go, son. Oh, Raycroft with a great glove save. That was nice. Nice hit by Nedved, but of course he couldn't pick up the puck because that would be too easy. Right, over to you, York. York, you've got to skate, mate. Come on, man. Okay, over. And nobody's there. Nobody's there for the bloody pass. Oh, okay, York's got it. And he gets hip checked. The problem is the animation can happen even if you're like two strides away, which really doesn't help. I've got to be honest. Shot. Oh, that was a decent shot there. Right, we've got the last minute of the game. No, thank you, son. How have we not got that? Right, let's go. Let's go, York. Let's go, York. Over. Shoot it, Smith. Oh, God. Right, the hero line's out there. Porkov, Smith, a couple of other guys. Oh, I need to win a face-off here. Come on. Okay, trying to hit that. Thornton, nope. Okay, can we, can we get the puck, please, guys? Two-line pass. I hate the two-line passes. Go away. You've ruined it for me. Ah, why? Okay, once again. Oh, Sh Sean Thornton is just killing me with these bloody face-offs. Sit down. Oh, and Sergei Samsonov. He gets revenge for earlier. And he gets the goal. Thornton was the captain of the Boston Bruins. I didn't even realise that. There you go. There you go. It's going to be a 4-2 game. We took a 2-1 lead after the first period, but... Thornton, stop it! You keep nicking all my bloody face-offs. Right, Horkov. Good try. I just find it really tough to actually make a decent play in this game. Offensively, I'm finding it so tough. Like, one of the goals I've got is sweaty as. That's what you get for scoring a goal, mate. Right, in the final seconds of the game. And there you go. A 4-2 win for the Boston Bruins. So, in terms of the actual gameplay itself, it is quite clunky. Like, the actual controls of it. I think if I had a controller, it might be a little bit better. But, um, your players go out of position so easily. Like, you just tap the right arrow key or the left arrow key. Oh, the three stars. And they come out of position so easily. And that means the other person can just rush in for a breakaway. I swear, I may have had one breakaway in this entire game. Whereas their team had about six. And, of course, that's to do with how I played as a uh, Glenn Murray with the bloody first star. That, uh, of course, the, um, the breakaways for the other team may have been somewhat to do with how awfully I played defensively. But also, at the same time, like, their defensemen always seem to be back. Their defensemen were always there. I think I may have had a one-on-one -on -one maybe once or twice. It was always one-on-two. And I don't know how that works. Like, how do you beat out the defensemen? Because the, the second you get close to it, they just rub you off the puck super easily, which is a bit of a pain in the ass. I've got to be honest. 
But yeah, that was NHL 2005. I mean, it's not really the best game we've played. It's very much middle of the line, I would argue. It's definitely not the worst. I, I had fun. It was fast-paced, it was quick, and I was enjoying every second of it. But I can understand why this game got bad reviews on the PC version. It's very clunky. Um, the defense just seems overpowered to shit. I'm not going to lie. Like, they are super OP, the defense of the AI. But um, yeah, I thought it was a fun game. But yes, thank you very much for watching, guys. I'm going to end this episode here. Um, if you have any other suggestions for games you would like me to play in the Hockey Game History series, let me know in the comments below. I'd love to hear what you guys think. But please feel free to like, subscribe, share, or watch some of my other videos. Thank you very much for watching, and goodbye!